Hello everyone, I hope you all are fine and I hope everything great for you. Welcome to Civil Curious channel and another video. In this video, I'm going to talk about the main differences between shear ball and retaining ball. You see, as you know, retaining ball is used uh, when we want to hold a, whole, a large number of soil behind it. And in this video, I'm going to show that this is our retaining ball, you see, and works uh, here. And this is the number of number of uh, huge soil behind it and the retaining ball should hold it and as you know shear ball works in plan in plane you see and uh, when uh, we want to have structural issues we use it and this is our shear ball you see uh, the main difference that I'm going to address here it is that uh, retaining ball has out of plane movement and shear ball has in plane movement and that is really important and the, and the main difference you see for example this is a soil and I want to move the ball out of plane you see it moves like this and the uh, movement is like this and you see works here and what the shear ball has in plane movement and move like this it is in plane movement and the uh, movement is like that you see uh, here we solve in moment of inertia you see uh, for example this retaining ball has B in width and H in height and this shear ball B prime and H prime I'm gonna uh, calculate the moment of inertia of retaining ball as we know moment of inertia is equal to uh, 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 you see as you know it is it has out of plane working you know like this and the the moment of inertia is h p 3 divided by 12 and the moment of inertia of uh, shear ball is because of in plane movement b h 3 divided by 12 and this moment of inertia is highly greater than this moment of inertia you see because of in-plane movement uh, and that is the main difference you know and i'm going to repeat that the main difference is that retaining ball has out of plane movement because of uh, soil behind it and wants to move it like this and shear ball has in-plane movement because of earthquake loading see wants to work like this uh, and in play movement and the moment of inertia of shear ball shear ball <coughs> sorry is highly greater than retaining ball and that is really important i hope uh, you all enjoy my video and if you like it please subscribe my channel to motivate me to create more videos thank you everybody thank you